And we'll put some legs in here. Yeah, it looks good. There we go. Um, to join that bit up. There we go. Accidentally ruin the entire artistic and oh god, the artistic integrity of the piece. Do we? No, of course we don't. Yeah, uh, join. Well, uh, happy little leg in there. Um, there is a one. I, I, um, and, uh, I guess a nose. Uh, he's a wolf, so he's going to want, want teeth. Wolves have teeth, right? I imagine that's very satisfying for our fox boy. But you know, you got to stay true to the to the animal, don't you? There we go. Don't know why he's on all fours. Don't know why he's basically just a dog. I think I may have got the wrong idea of this whole whole fairy porn thing. Um, but I think I think it, think it's about right. I think it's that, that'll do right. That'll do. Um, going to upload this to uh, some porn site. I'm, I'm sure there's there's plenty out there. And uh, if you want me to take commissions, I'm charging uh, five hundred pound to pop. Draw your, your 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 the the fairy porn you want. Um, yeah, I, I I know I'm incredibly talented, so you don't have to you don't have to fawn over me too hard. But this is this is my new calling, I think. Um, honestly, I don't know where I'm going with this bit. I thought it would be kind of funny, but it 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 turned out it wasn't. Um, shall we play the game? I guess that's what I <laughs> I can't look at this any longer. Let's go, let's go play the game. Um, let's, let's, let's open the Steams. Um, Deadbolt, that's what we're playing. That's what we're playing. Um, yeah, let, let's play Deadbolt. Um. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Um, yeah, I'm... Today I'm playing Deadbolt. It's made by the guys who made Risk of Rain, which is a game I I very much enjoyed. Um, me and my mates played an awful lot of it. From what I understand, Deadbolt is nothing like Risk of Rain. However, Risk of Rain being a side-scrolly, shooty, roguelike, manic pickup thing, um, with all the co-ops and all the, the the fun and the bosses and everything. Whereas this, from what I can tell, is something more akin to Hotline Miami, or what's that game where you, the the mayor was an evil rabbit and you had to go and kill people for him? You know the one I mean, the the, the purple rabbit man. Yeah, I think it's something somewhat akin to that. I don't really know for sure though. All I've got to go on is a few screenshots and the fact that this game was was cheap because they sent me a coupon because I already owned Risk of Rain, so that's why I'm playing it. Here's hoping it's going to be fun though, so let us, let's do it. Another night! Huh. Okay, so we got the old A and D to move side to side. We've got uh, R to knock on the door. Hello? Hello, anyone there? No, okay. An E to open it. The uh, the art style is very similar to Risk of Rain. I'll, I'll give them that. It's a, it's a cool art style, I think. They they have the very hop hopu games. I think they're called. They have a, clearly a very uh, distinct style. Um, there's a guy on the shitter in there, but I guess we have to go this way. Oh, I don't know if the music was meant to kick in as I went upstairs there, or if that was just a coincidence. But it was damn cool. Um, okay, we've got a knife. Can we have another knife? We can have two knives. Never have enough knives. And then you walk up and you left click. Left click, left click, left click. Oh, wow, okay. That was... The alerted toilet, man. Hello. Oh, that blood is... That's something else, isn't it? 
pretty drastic. Take cover behind the TV, we can take cover behind the couch, we can take cover behind... no. No, we can't. Oh, what? Interesting. This isn't something I was aware of. I mean, I wasn't aware of much in this game, really. <laughs> it's been my first experience with it, but... Yeah, I didn't see this one coming. Okay. Hello! Oh. <laughs> right, okay, so it's, it's not exactly forgiving. Gotcha. You can stab these fellas up pretty good, though. Come on. Come on. Right, I'll just be... Hello! Right here. If I go up here, he's going to see me and he's going to shoot me. If I go through the vent, he's going to see me and he's going to shoot me. Hang on, hold right click. Oh, we can throw knives. This might possibly change everything, potentially. Yeah, that did it. That did it good. Get the gun. You could throw the gun. Oh. Oh. I was trying to work out how to use the gun. That wasn't fair. You gotta give me time to learn these mechanics. They're very complex. Oh, I d no, no! Oh, he throws where the cursor's pointing. That's probably something I should have. I should have expected. <laughs> well, I'm off to a great start with this game, but I'm learning. I'm learning. See? Yeah, threw a knife at that guy. Didn't need to, but I did. The wrong door. Fuck it now. Oh. <laughs> I'm surprised I did that first time because it's 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 more tricky than it looks. You using a cursor is kind of out of my my field of expertise to be honest. I mostly uh play games where all I have to do is select a command from a menu, so all this uh complexity is getting a bit too much for me. Got him. Oh, okay, the gun the gun works the same. Hold right and then left to, to fire it. I didn't know if that would throw the gun in. I don't know why you'd ever throw a gun, so. Cool. Alright, we did it. Guys, we did it. We complete. No, we didn't. We didn't complete it. There's more. I thought the game was over, but I guess not. Let's enter this vent. Begin from the shitter. As... Honestly, of all the ways to infiltrate a building, coming up through the toilet probably isn't my favourite. Knock knock, knock knock. Interesting, takes one knife but two bullets. Therefore knives are the superior weapon. Two of them down here, this is going to be serious. Can I? Oh fuck, hello. <laughs> Well, he got me good. He caught me right off guard. I like I like doing this. This is this is pretty badass. It's like something straight out of a uh, 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 action movie. Very very Tarantino. This whole game's got a bit of a, a Tarantino feel to it, don't you think? I don't know. Maybe you don't think. Hey, what? Take care of these two lads first. They never see me coming. And then uh, in no, in fact, what? Oh, turn the lights off. That's pretty nifty. And what's? Oh, okay. Which weapon? I <laughs> just noticed that there's graffiti on the wall. Don't know why he wasn't shooting at me, but I'm okay with it. Worked out quite nicely for me, all things considered. Okay, this game's dead simple. Oh. I got four stars. That could have been worse. I don't know how I got four stars. I, I died five times and missed 
Uh, my accuracy wasn't bad. My accuracy wasn't bad. I, I gotta give myself that. Oh, you're finally back. Is that it? You're not gonna talk anymore? Okay. Sit and talk. <laughs> the flames roar to life and a voice speaks out. Another life. Well returned. I don't know if it's the same guy. Okay. That was that was a good chat. I'm glad we glad we enjoyed it. Let's choose a mission, shall we? Oh, look at all these options we have. We know literally nothing about any of them. So I'll tell you what, we'll start right here in the middle. No? Okay, we won't start right here in the middle. I'm trying to select a mission. Can I, can I select a mission? Guess I'm not allowed to do any of those. Oh, the, the man's gone. The candlestick face man's gone. Punch this light switch, good. It's telling me to go back in the chair. Oh, we need to click this. I got gotcha. you. My candles tell me tales. Undead form and blossom. Find their abode and knock and free them from their jails. Flames never spoke in prose. Mission unlocked. Undead are easiest to kill when alone. Violics and snares. Undead, zombies included, must be helped towards the afterlife. Okay. Okay, how'd the E to exit got you? Gotcha. Games, this game is very tough. Okay, so now we can do this one. Gotta kill all the undead. All of them. Every single one. Okay. To be fair, these undead, they seem to be having a good time. You know, they don't seem to be suffering in their afterlife. They, they're just... You know, they're doing their thing. I don't think there's any real reason to kill them. I mean, yeah, okay, fine. They're noisy neighbours, I get that. That's probably a bit annoying for some people. But See, this is how you do it. Unless they can follow me down the toilet. And they ain't got shit on this. Bitch. Sorry, I'm getting me, yeah. Uh... What was he called? Jesse? Good Jesse, wasn't it? I can't... Jesse Pink something. Okay, now. I liked Breaking Bad as well, but for some reason I can't remember what the fucking characters are called. Why is that guy just pointing the gun at the door? I thought, I thought he was shooting at me, but then he wasn't. We got a bit of a toilet patrolling issue going on up here. And then if I come out this end, there's two guys with guns. Three guys with guns, in fact. So, uh... Gonna have to bide our time for a bit, I think. It's alright, those two have gone off upstairs. Just need to hop up and deal with this fella. Who I think knows I'm here. Hmm. Seems like both of my exits are barred. This is quite a predicament I find myself in. I'm just going to have to be very good at playing video games to deal with this. Wait for it. Wait, wait for it. Wait, wait. <laughs> okay, that maybe wasn't quite how that should have gone. do this, but this doesn't really put me in a nice position, to be honest. Oh wait, hang on, maybe it does. Wait for it. No? Yes. There we go. That's another one. Anyone else coming up? Shit. Seems I'm out of ammo. Ha! <laughs> this game's a tricky one. Tricky game for tricky people. 
It's all right. I'm a video gaming expert. I'll, I'll work this one out. Maybe I could have just like switched pistols or something. That would have been a good idea, wouldn't it? Ooh, that was close. You two gonna go downstairs now? Yep. Perfect. Oh, what did he drop? He dropped a thing. I see, I only have two bullets left in my pistol and then I'll have to switch to my revolver. Oh, fuck. Uh, just... <laughs> hmm. That was, that was a close one. That was a, some risky business. Fuck! 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 Oh. I don't know if this game is meant to be hard or if I'm just really bad at it. I think it's a little bit of both, perhaps. I've got a plan. My plan's working. Just need to not fuck it up. You're thinking this guy's gonna come down and get me, but he, he doesn't seem that bothered. All things considered. Come on. Come on, lads, upstairs. You heard gunshots. Don't pretend you didn't. Now you're just gonna walk straight past the door. Oof. There we go. Alright, uh, just this top floor fella now. Oh! <laughs> oh, only I could make that mistake. Oh, shit, didn't die in one hit that time. I guess I must have not been a headshot. Why no one's coming running? No one seems that bothered by the noise upstairs. Makes life somewhat difficult for me. Maybe I can just do this instead, though. Shit! <laughs> oh, that was that was close. That was very very close. I mean, honestly, just going in guns blazing seems to work more often than not. I can't help but notice that I only have one bullet left now, though, and two zombies to kill. Which might, might just be an issue. I guess we're gonna have to... Can we not equip fists? I mean, I can just hide here forever. I'm not sure this guy runs out of ammo, though. Get him! <laughs> I assume there is some sort of melee takedown. There usually is in games like this, but... I've... I'm wary of trying to use it. Almost forgot to turn the lights off. That's an important part of my strategy. There we go. Actually, they've been triggered by my noise this time. Just as I planned it. Right, four bullets, three guys. Pretty certain that's a filthy porn site. Okay, two bullets, two guys. This might not go well. Have to make sure this is a head. Oh fuck! I clicked twice. <laughs> oh. Okay, now that the uh, canine based interruption has been dealt with, I'll get back to my, my plan. Hey, that's how you do it one shot, one kill. Easy peasy. It's gotta not be too gung ho with the gun guns. Gun ho. Gun ho. Are you a gun ho? Right. This is going well. I've got the revolver ammo I've still got left. Don't know why the guy on the top floor is completely deaf. Makes life easy for me though, doesn't it? Oh, thought he was coming. No. Oh, fuck. oh, fuck off! 
can't use your own friend's corpse as a shield. That's that's not even fair. Let me try something. Boof, 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 boof. <laughs> well, it works, but it takes a while. I guess we'll we'll stick with the with the guns for now. Close thing. Right. Um. Tell you what, we go this side, turn the lights off, and wait. There we go. There we go, we did it. Are you proud of me? Are you proud of me now, Daddy? <laughs> Honestly, I was drawing furry porn earlier, so probably not. Well, that took me nearly 10 minutes, and I died seven times. But I killed eight people, so that's one more, right? That's that's means I, I broke even, at least. What's this? Oh, I got that cassette. C cassette? Cassette. I wake up. Cold water. Dogs again. Blenders in my hand. Where am I? Roland's here. He helps. He says we leave. He says we don't have time to come back to the docks again. He gives me a hit. A good hit. I feel it in my tongue and my throat and my hands and my feet and my ears and I wake up. How much time? Thumping in my ear. Music. I look down and there's splinters in my hand. Roland's gone. I die again. I overdose again. I wake up. Hands wet, feet wet, dogs again. I'm in a living room. I need more ash. Roland? I hear the music again, I hear yelling. The room fills up with cold water, I splinter, and we all overdose again. I wake up, knocking at the door. Roland? Quite the story. Haha! <laughs> I like how you can turn the music off and it like slowly winds down because it's a record player. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I like that. I like a lot of things about this game. It's not my kind of game, really, honestly. Um, if it wasn't made by by Hopu, made a game I absolutely adore, I probably wouldn't be playing it right now. But it is doing a lot of things very, very nicely. There's a lot of lot of things winning me over here. What's the mission then? The undead powers begin to crop strange powders from below. Inside the flame, eject their brains and see what it contains. There's a bouncer on the far side of the house. I can kill him to get his weapon. A new drug called Ash. His candles say that it makes you feel like you're alive again. The flames, my employer, they want to know more. Okay. It's cool that there's a plot, but it feels kind of like... Sparkles. Need to kill that guy and get his shit, got you. But uh, yeah, no, I say, it's, it, I like that there is a plot involved here, but it does feel like the plot is somewhat surplus to requirements, like... You do the game, and then you get some plot, and then you do the game, and then you get some plot. There's there's not really... The two things aren't really interwoven very well, is what I'm trying to say. Hello. Hello. I'm liking this. Hello. <laughs> Later. Hello. Hammer is best weapon. Why would I ever use anything else? Okay, boy. Come closer. Closer. Oh, okay. His reactions are faster than mine. Gotcha. Still. 
this works nicely. I'm very proud of what I did here. Let's do it again. <laughs> it is satisfying. It really is. The, the combat is very satisfying. As I say, it's not really my sort of game, and I'm probably not going to make this into a full Let's Play. But, that said, it, it's definitely a cool little game if you're into this sort of thing. Oh dear, I think I may be in trouble. Okay, aiming your gun takes you out of cover. Gotcha. I'm learning. Yeah, I could take the subtle approach and knock on the door and everything, or I could just do that. Hello! <laughs> oh, this guy heard me this time. Hmm. That's it. Come hither. Come to me. Let's not take the vent this time, because that didn't really... But can we just... Yes, we can just... Alright, we'll be up here. We'll take out this fella. See, now we're talking. I think the revolver's like... Seems to do more damage than the pistol. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just... Either way. It can be easily sold with a knock knocking on the door. There we go. So that just leaves the big boy. See if this works. It does. Cool. Got a sawn off shotgun. Oh, I want I want the hammer back. I don't want to keep the shotgun. This the stuff we Oh no, we just need to kill all undead. The powder is actually just completely irrelevant to the the, the, the mission. That's fair enough. Uh, let's try out the shotgun, shall we? <laughs> I like it. Um, and now go back to the car. Where does this go? Oh. Bit irrelevant, isn't it? I'm liking the shotgun, though. The thing packs a punch. Hoping I get to keep it. I don't know how taking things across missions really works in this. If it does, in fact, at all. Look at that, two deaths, four minutes. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. But only three stars, apparently. I mean, fine, if that's how you're going to be, but... I tried. I definitely tried. Flames roar to life when I see visions inside. The fireplace began to speak. Oh, probably shouldn't be in the fireplace voice. Flesh caskets breathe, burn the ash, and scatter the teeth. Alright, I don't know what that means. I see two entrances to the house. The left entrance has less zombies, but the right entrance has more weapons. My choice. I see visions of Sharon, the ferryman. He may be interested in the souls I have collected for our mutual employer. I should see him at the docks before my next mission. Oh, interesting. Sharon lives at the docks. Is it Sharon or Caron? I don't really know. I can exchange souls for weapons before I accept my mission. All I know about, about that dude is that he's like a dude who drives a ferry in mythology. And in the amazing, underrated Xbox 360 game Dante's Inferno, he is a big boat with a face on it. And at one point he gets like exploded and lodged in a wall and it's hilarious. Fuck you, that game was awesome. I was meant to go see, see Caron. I didn't. Hmm. I can come up inside this guy's ass. That's... That's gonna be pretty. Oh! You can just do that. Okay, you can just... I literally did come up inside his ass and just exploded him from within. That's... That's something.
I do it was best to not stick around in there. Let's approach from the other side now. Got some knives, got some whatever that is. Might be fun. Boo. Oh, no one heard that, really? I burnt your drugs, bitches. Why, why, are, why are the zombies all druggies? I don't... Is that what makes you a zombie in this world, dying from a drug overdose? Oh, fuck. Alright then. Maybe we should deal with the big guy sooner rather than later and get his shotgun. Maybe that will be a sensible approach to this. Still get this fella first. Because he's fair game. Because let's face it. Then we're going to want to get the big boy. Shit, out of ammo. Come on, upstairs. Nope, okay. Huh, right. We're gonna need a more powerful gun, it seems, in order to deal with him. There are knives on the desk over there, and I know they pack a punch. If I get my hands on one of them, that would be cool. I don't think there's any way of getting past him that easily, though. Hmm. Is the plan. Go on. Go upstairs. Check out upstairs. You know what? interested to see if I can telefrag this guy if he comes over my vent. Come on. Come on. Come on, a little bit closer. A little bit closer. A little bit closer. Come on, no, no don't, go, don't go back that way. No, think of all the, the fun times we've had together. You're going to throw all that away? Come, embrace my smoke. You're meant to be a druggie, aren't you? Come, come inhale me. Come on, come on, just a few steps, no, not not that way, come on, come on, a little bit closer, a little bit, cl little bit closer, you, you, you keep nearly getting there, and then you keep turning around, tell you what, I'll leave, I'll make you more comfortable with the situation, I don't think this plan's, I don't think it's going to work, I'm going to be honest, boo, oh ha ha, ha, <laughs> oh. That shouldn't have worked. Well aware that that shouldn't have worked. I didn't deserve that one at all. Alright, well I'd up here. Give this guy a stabbing. Take his gun. We got the shotgun. With which we can do this. There we go. Out of shotgun ammo, but it was satisfying, right? I didn't even really need to kill those guys. I only have to destroy Ash Cat Ash Ca Ash Catchem. We only have to destroy Ash Catchem. Come on, both of you. Oh, that was cool. This game has a way of making you feel like you're good at doing things. Pull off something that's relatively simple and it just looks badass, you know. I like it. I like it so much. As I said, there's not really. From a sort of 
gameplay and commentary perspective, there's, there's not a great deal I can really talk about, you know? The missions are what they are. They're fun. They're, they're satisfying, as I say. There's a, there's a certain catharsis to just stabbing a guy up or throwing a knife at him or whatever. In fact, I'll take a knife. I don't need all this pissed up pistol ammo. But it's like... Oh, stage is cleared, I can just go to my car. <laughs> Went too much effort into this. But it's like, what else is there, you know? It's a fun little game to play, but not so much to, uh, as I say, do a let's play on. Which is why this will probably be the only video on it. We'll do one more stage, then. One more for good luck. No moment to flee. He should not be here. A man with a heart cannot live with me. Shadows cast along the wall and the flame show me silhouettes of Puff's death. This is the first time my employer has given me a specific target. I succumb to the thrill. Oh, hello. Go through. Oh, this is how we get to the docks. Okay. Here he is, old flaming eyes himself. Oh, we can buy weapons. Will I always start with the, these guns if I if I buy them? Honestly, just starting with a knife would be cool. That thing's pretty badass. Fourteen bullets, yes please. Only holds five. Uh, it's loud as well. Mm, can buy most of these. Yeah, nine millimeter SMG. Can't afford the shotgun. Or the scythe. Let's uh, tell you what. We'll take the death and taxes. Oh, it's two. It's dual pistols. Yes. Yes. Thank you. And we'll also take the knife. I could have had the hammer instead. I think the knife's probably probably more satisfying though, to be fair. Um, thanks. I don't know how I decide which ones I I start with. Is there some way of doing a loadout? Why does How do both exits to this place take me back there? It's a strange world. Oh hello, there's a there's a thing over here. We wanna. I wanna know how to. I see my weapons on the board. See them. Maybe I, I start with them all. They're just like in my car or something. Whatever. Let's just go on the mission. Roland, I think he's here. They know me so well. Aha! I will take death and taxes, thank you. And the knife, thank you. And this is what we like. Oh, damn. Didn't quite work out that time, did it? Okay, this is these aren't accurate apparently. It's fine. <laughs> they do the trick. Oh, I think big boy's coming. Oh, is he not? Is he? Is he not? Is he? Is he? Okay, this only takes me to there. These guys have got some pretty nifty shit downstairs. Maybe I should try dealing with them. I'm gonna be a a bit mental when I go down there. Wait till he's away. Oh shit! That's not. That didn't take me. That was. The, that was the wrong. That was. That was the wrong. Oof. Okay, I might be in trouble now. It's very possible that I'm in trouble now. Help! Ah! 
Okay. Need to take a slightly more subtle approach, I see. I do enjoy doing that. Right, we'll go downstairs first. Deal with these two. That's not how you that's not how you shoot things, Joe. You don't just unload on the floor. Dabbing up the door. Oh shit. Okay. Uh oh. Got a problem now, haven't we? Got a problem now. You can't see me. I'm in the shadows. This is my only my only real chance here. Oh, nearly. Nearly got to punch him in the face. Oh, for fuck's sake, every time. Alright, we're gonna need that shotgun. Come on. Up you come. Up you come, I'm ready for you. Ooh. We can swap out death and taxes for these fellas. Can we burn their merch? No, they don't they don't care. Okay, fair enough. I just called it merch. Me talking like I know what the hell I'm on about. My drug lingo. Ooh, a sawn off shot oh wait, I've already got a sawn off shotgun. Okay, whatever. Um. No. Okay. I do be taking out this guy quietly, but I don't think either of my guns facilitate quiet. I'm just gonna have to pop up, blast him in the face, and leg it. I think. Should have gone in the vent. Should have gone in the vent. These levels are hard. Real Dark Souls starts here, you know. Ooh. You see that knife bounce then? I was so lucky. I like death and taxes, but they are monstrously inaccurate. Right, okay. Grab the shotgun. We'll do the same we did last time, because let's face it, there isn't really any other options. But we'll, we'll make for the vent this time. My best plan. In fact, if we make for this vent... Oh, that could work. Oh no, I was in the vent! I was in the vent! I was definitely in the vent! Fuck you! Fuck you! I don't deserve this. Loving the knife bounce. Okay, so. Maybe going for that vent's a bit risky. We'll just pop up, go back down through this vent. Just gotta wait till we get a chance at the big boy alone. Kind of hoping. These fellas would follow me down here, to be honest. They don't seem that willing though, they seem to be seem to prefer the idea of just patrolling up and down there a lot. Don't think a shotgun's gonna one shot them. So here's the plan. Stairs, both of you. Got him. And that's how the pros do it. I still have to wait. Find information. Shit, we're not done yet. Get, get, get it. Get it. Desk has a filing cabinet. Maybe there's some useful information here. Pull open the filing cabinet. There are two separate tabs. This tab is full of loose papers. Oh god. Pull open the drawer, and inside is a pamphlet and an embossed coin. 
basic financing, letter outputting puff, go output your puff, uh, poorly drawn picture of a naked vampire, pretty great. Aha, labelled important people, these are the addresses scribbled across the top. Some stuff. Cool. We found what we were after, I guess, and apparently the bad guys disappeared. Oh, they've gone downstairs. Well, I guess this is my chance to bail. They've, they've gone to guard their, their drugs, so I guess I can leave. Puff. <laughs> yeah, I know I died a lot, but it's a hard level, alright? I think three stars is fair. I think I deserved a th a three stars for, for pulling that off at all. I <laughs> don't think you should be able to get lower than three stars on that level. If you, if you do it, you're you're a three star boy. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna wind up here. Um, this is Deadlock. No, sorry, it's not. It's Deadbolt. I just called it by the wrong name. I'm sorry. This is Deadbolt. If you think it looks cool, then go buy it. I, th I think it's pretty fun, and I'll probably be playing it more myself. But as I say, not really the sort of thing worth showing off to you guys um yeah cool shooting people is fun and don't let anyone tell you any different <laughs> uh, fuck bye